Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel! And on today's video, I'm going to continue my me time talk. The first episode I uploaded already, you can check it out. And if you are new here, welcome and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also share this video to your friends. So actually on today's video, um, it's me time talk second episode and on today's video we're going on to the topic friends right i know all of you here have friends right you can't live without other human beings so you need to communicate and all stuff like that so i'm going to take this topic as my second episode so the best thing to know about friends is finding who your true friends are true friends are actually hard to find and i'm sure there are a lot of toxic people coming in your way coming into your life but they just want to be near you when you're succeeding or when you're at your highest point but sometimes they may be there when you fail or when you're down because they like the enjoyment of seeing you down or seeing you fail seeing you not succeeding they like their enjoyment and they want to talk about you and all stuff like that and i consider that as toxic friends because they are not even supporting us they are not there for us and yeah so here we go into the topic deeper deeper talk okay so actually uh, my point of true friends are the ones who's there for you the ones who support you in every situation even when you're up or you're down like they don't they don't leave you when you are in your lowest point and for me true friends are the one who always there for you if you need someone to talk to if you need a shoulder to cry on if you yeah, if you're complaining, they're always there. They're always there for you and they make time for you. That's what I called a true friends. And I'm sure I can count my true friends, who my true friends are, who my friends are, and who are the toxic people in my life. I know that. And I'm telling you guys that I don't have a lot of true friends. And I guess it's hard to find who your true friends are because you need to click you know you need to click like you need to be able to trust them you need to be able to make them happy to be happy with them as well like it's just like relationship but then this one is friendship i can count who my true friends are i can count three three or four yeah from my elementary school till now yeah i can only count four four people in my life that really matters to me four of my friends that i care about that i truly care about that i consider them as my family as my second family and yeah they're always been there for me and i'm thankful for that because i finally found who my true friends are i know it's not a lot but then i appreciate that and i appreciate what they did for me what, like they've been there for me when i need them the most so yeah and for me, toxic friends are like, uh, they try to take everything from you and they never have time, they never help. Like When you need something, they are not there. But when they need something, you are always there. So it's like one-way relationship, one-way friendship. So I guess that one is toxic. And I think toxic uh, friendship is like, um, they say nice thing to your face but then they say bad things behind your back about you to someone else so i guess that one is toxic and i suggest you to stay away from people like that because they are not your friends they are yeah just like that so i suggest you to get away from them from their lives and what i learned from friends is they come and go um before i used to think that ah oh, maybe when i'm in my elementary school i was saying like oh let's be friends until we're old and blah, 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 blah. but then some didn't work out and i finally realized that oh some people are only in 
a part of your life like they won't be there forever maybe they are put in that place or they are put in that time to teach you something to teach you a lesson that you need to learn so i guess mm, that's something you need to learn that friends come and go you can't expect everyone to stay with you forever you can't even you you need to move on with your life you have a new life you have a new environment so yeah that happened and i just feel like some people are seasonal like maybe when i'm in high school yeah i met those people but when i step into university i'm i'm friends with new people again like yeah you can't stick with what you have forever because you need to adapt you need to change and i suggest you to just make the most with what you have right now if you have this thing right now then make the most out of it no need to wanting more wanting more and all stuff like that mm, and i guess with your friends you learn something you you learn that maybe you learn part of your life journey that you can't even tell to everyone like you can't tell to anyone because it just happened and you learn something which is good if you learn something <laughs> and yeah because um i feel like friends also have a chapter that we need to close like not everyone will stay in your life forever we all know that and maybe uh some of our friends didn't stay for long because maybe they leave or you guys drifted apart or you guys don't talk anymore because you have a new life it's not because like something personal like not because that you guys are mad at each other but then some people some of your friends it's just seasonal you know like the chapter finished already like either they live in different country or they live like to go into university they have new friends you have new friends yeah so you guys may drift it apart because it happened to me once not once yeah probably lots of time but then what i learned like i'm really close with this girl oh uh, we've been friends for probably four years my high school but then now now things just didn't go how it's supposed to be of how what i think like things have changed between us we talk we still talk but then it's just different we are not as close as we used to be in high school but then yeah we're still friends and maybe we drifted apart because of distance we didn't talk and all stuff like that so i guess that's one of the reason why people come and go and why you are not friends with the one you're friends with back then so yeah because you guys you both grew as a person and i just feel like when the season is new then you meet new people just like when i step into university i meet new friends i meet new people and i'm only friends with some people back then like in my high school not not all not a lot but then i'm only friends with one or two so yeah and for me what uh it means by true friends is that we don't need to talk every day but then they're always there when you need them because I have this one friend of mine we live in different country we met in china and we didn't talk every day and now we don't talk every day because i'm in indonesia now and she's in cambodia like but we're still friends and she's always there when i need someone to talk to i'm always there when she needs someone to talk to and yeah our relationship just go well and nothing weird between us like even though we don't talk to each other every day but then we know that we're always there when you need when you need a shoulder to cry on when you need someone to talk to we're always there for each other and that's what i call true friends because i know true friends are hard to find and i'm thankful that i found my true friends although it's not a lot but i'm thankful for that because quality over quantity <laughs> like uh, she considered me as a priority as her priority and I consider her as my priority so yeah it just happened like that and even with my friend high school back then we're still friends and we're still best friend until now and I'm thankful for that like when I'm in China we don't talk every day we barely talk but then when I go back to Indonesia we like 
yeah we talk we have fun and she's always there when i need her like even when i'm in my lowest point she's always there and i rely so much on her and yeah i i'm just thankful to have her in my life because she's such a kind person she's she's a good 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 friend and mm, i guess uh what and i guess what i mean by toxic friendship is that mm, like she she or he or your best friend don't consider you as a priority when you text them they reply late or they don't reply or they reply a day after or they reply a week after which is not good because maybe you really need them the most but then they're not there and i consider that as toxic friendship and they're not your real friends i know everyone use their phone especially in um nowadays people use their phone really like they have always their phone in their hand you know and maybe that's the reason why they are not responding to your text because they just don't want to be there for you and you guys should realize that that they are not your true friends you need to find your true friends maybe they reply like a week after i know people are busy i know people have life but they won't take that long to reply a day two days doesn't make sense at least people check five minutes of their phones a day right and i guess what can make your friendship drifted apart is that jealousy like your friend is jealous of you it can end friendship because they want to be above you and instead of supporting you on what you're doing right now but yes most of my friends no not most of my friends most of the people i realized that 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 they're just jealous and that's why they want to bring you down and that's why they don't like seeing you succeeding they don't like seeing you happy and all stuff like that so i consider that one also as a fake friends and yeah i guess i talk long enough right now <laughs> yeah actually um that's it what i want to talk about friendship like you need to find your true friends who your true friends are and if you haven't find them then continue finding because i'm sure you will find one who clicks with you who's always there with you and i hope you remove toxic people from your life because it's it can eat you up alive like mentally physically all stuff like that so yeah i suggest you to find who your true friends are no need to hurry but then when the time comes he or she will come with you i guess that's it for the video i hope you guys enjoy i hope you guys like it and i hope you guys get some advice get some new thoughts on how your friendship goes so yeah i guess that's it for the video i hope you guys enjoy i hope you guys like it and if you do like it please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to comment down below and also share this video to your friends and don't forget to subscribe to this channel bye 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 bye, bye.